The following video contains scenes that are not suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey man, you can know you watch. Alright viewers and subscribers, my name is Danza Skiller. Yes, I am here again. Big up and respect to each and everyone. Now, I have two videos that I'm going to present to you, my viewers and subscribers. But before I present any of those videos to you, I would like to let you know about some things that I read in a news article where it is said that a 16-year-old girl from within the parish of St. Thomas, that is within a country that is known as Jamaica, is said to be missing. Sometime within the month of October, the year 2021, there are separate reports about separate incidents where it is said that both a 9-year-old girl and a 13-year-old girl are missing. It is said that both the 9-year-old girl and the 13-year-old girl are from the parish that is known as St. Thomas, that is within a country that is known as Jamaica. Allegedly, it is said that both the 9-year-old girl and the 13-year-old girl was abducted by a man who goes by the name of Davian Brian during separate incidents. It is said that during separate incidents, both the 9-year-old girl and the 13-year-old girl was found. It is said that they are alive and they had returned to their family and according to other information it is said that the person who goes by the name of Davian Brand is on the run. Now according to some things that I read in this news article that I saw I got the understanding that the news article said that a 16 year old girl from within the same parish is said to be missing. Now I am not the one saying these things viewers and subscribers and as proof here's a screenshot of the news article that I'm talking about. The news article did not show any picture of the 16-year-old girl who is said to be missing. According to the news article, it is said that the missing 16-year-old girl goes by the last name of Henry. I am not sure how to pronounce it. The first name that I saw in the news article that is said to be the missing 16-year-old girl's first name. However, I am going to spell it and that is N-I-J-E-R-A-Y. It is said that she is from Whitehall District from within the parish of St. Thomas, that's within the country of Jamaica. And it is said that she has been missing from the 14th of October, the year 2021. It is said that the missing girl is of brown complexion and that she is stout built. It is said that she is 122 centimeters tall or 4 feet tall. It is said that she was last seen at the Marant Bay Market, that is within the parish of St. Thomas, that's within the country of Jamaica, wearing pink blouse and pink leggings. It is said that she had not been heard from since. Now viewers and subscribers, this whole situation right there is another sad situation again viewers and subscribers. So I'm just letting you know about the things that I read in the news article that I saw just in case if this whole situation is as what it said to be. All right. All right. Now I'm going to move on to a video. Now the first video that I am going to present to you, this video is going to show how a preacher separately spit on a few persons during a church service that was held somewhere out there in the world. I do not have any confirmed information as to exactly where and when the video had been recorded. The video also shows when a female attacked the preacher because the preacher spit on her. Allegedly, it is said that the preacher spit on those persons because it is believed to be some form of blessing. Now, one of the reasons why I am presenting the video to you, my viewers and subscribers, is because the video is being talked about on social media. I'm also presenting the video to you so that you can take a look at the video for yourself and you can tell me what I think about the things that you are about to see and hear in this video. You can tell me if you think the preacher was wrong to spit on those persons or if you think it is okay. In my point of view, I think it is wrong that the preacher spit on those persons because I think it is not hygienic. However, you can tell me what to think about my opinion. You can tell me if you agree or if you disagree with my opinion. If you look at the video carefully and if you listen to the video, you might get an understanding as to if the preacher is a Jamaican or not. Now, viewers and subscribers, I'm going to present the video to you. But I want you to please bear in mind that this video shows how a preacher separately spit on a few persons. The video also shows when a female attacked the preacher because the preacher spit on her. So before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video are not suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's the video. Take a look, listen and observe.
nice and lady, you know, come for the power. Uh-huh. Yeah, leave left it. We wanna see, we wanna see, yeah. we wanna see Jesus oh. Blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. We wanna see the blood of Jesus. I trouble the devil in here. Blood of My people, for example, if you're at a location and you see that someone is hitting other persons on their risk and you do not like it, would you go in front of that person at the time when he's doing what he's doing to other persons? Would you even go in the presence of that person while he's hitting persons on their risk even though you do not like it? I'm just asking a question. My people, I'm going to say some things before I give you my opinion. You see, I would never disrespect anyone's belief nor their religion. No, I'm not that kind of person. And I've said those words in other videos that I've posted. But I would not participate in a church service like that. I would not participate in a church service similar to the one shown in the video that I just presented to you. No. And that's just how I feel. And I'm saying all these things with the most respect. You see me? However, you can let me know what you're thinking of viewers and subscribers. Each to their own. And I respect everyone's opinions and point of views. You see me? But I'm just telling you how I feel and what I think. With the most respect, of course. Alright? Anyways, I'm going to move on to another video. Now, the next video I'm going to present to you. This video is going to show some of the things that happened when police officers from within the country of Jamaica went to a place that is known as Top Road in Franklin Town, Kingston, Jamaica on the 14th of October the year 2021. I also got information that police officers who went to the place that is known as Top Road in Franklin Town, Kingston, Jamaica on the 14th of October the year 2021 had been accused of abusing a father and his son. I also got information that residents within the community that is known as Top Road in Franklin Town, Kingston, Jamaica protested because of the incident. And I also got information that the father and his son had been detained or arrested by police officers who went to that location on that day. Now, I'm going to present the video to you so that you can have a better understanding about the situation. But please bear in mind that in this video, you're going to hear persons yelling and shouting. And some of those persons was yelling and shouting at police officers who you are about to see in this video that I'm about to present to you. So before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's the video. Take a look, listen and observe. Look at the girl. be a fool, you should go away. Relax. 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 Hello, 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 don't come out by the police vehicle. You come to here with them accident, You can't go now. Wait till the police finish. Hello. Sorry. Yeah, push my first time. Criminal over there, Look here. Don't come 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 all right viewers and subscribers i have no more information about the situation where it is said that police officers from within the country of jamaica had been accused of abusing a father and his son however the situation is being talked about on social media, so me dance as killer, just to let you know what's going on, alright? You can let me know what to think about uh, the whole situation when it comes on to the whole thing where it is said that uh, police officers from within the country of Jamaica had been accused of abusing a father and his son, alright? Yeah, so you can let me know what to think about those videos that I presented to you. Here's where I'm going to leave it. So until the next time, if you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a video. All right. 
Until next time, my name is Dance Hall Skiller. You know, big up on yourself. Yes, eat. Hey, my youth, you know where you watch. Dance Hall Skiller! Yeah, man. Hey. hey, yo, Skiller! You are watching Dance Hall Skiller. Tint. Dance.